ALS has developed a sampling kit designed to simplify field deployment of EPA 325B samples. Use this short video as an overview of the kit and its contents. Sampling supplies may vary depending on the project. This video is a general guide. Contact your ALS project manager if you have questions about your particular project. Each sampling kit comes with the following items enclosed in a rigid, weatherproof case. Pre-labeled sampling tubes arranged in chronological order. Two 9 16 inch wrenches used for end cap removal. One pair of nitrile gloves used to prevent cross-contamination. Extra diffusion caps used for replacements as necessary. A clipboard, pen, and hard copy printed chain of custody form. Each client will receive a pre-filled chain of custody form and pre-labeled sampling tubes with each shipment. You are only responsible for filling in the start time, end time, barometric pressure, ambient temperature, and a relinquishing signature for each chain of custody form upon shipment. This value-added service saves time. It eliminates the guesswork involved in filling out a comprehensive chain of custody form on site. It also creates a chain of custody form that complies with the preferred sample identification outlined by method EPA 325B. To receive a pre-filled chain of custody form and labels with your shipment, fill out the data entry sheet on the electronic chain of custody form and return it to your ALS project manager via email no later than three business days prior to sample receipt. Without this information, your sampling kit will still be received on site. However, you will be responsible for sample labeling and chain of custody form completion. On the data entry sheet, fill out the yellow client information rows on top of the form and columns AA, BB, CC, DD, BOC, and the start and end date for each sample on the electronic chain of custody form. For further information on filling out the electronic chain of custody form, refer to the Instructions tab. Once the electronic chain of custody form is returned via email to your ALS project manager, the laboratory will assign an EPA 325B compliant sample tube to each associated sample ID and adhere an identification label to the outer polypropylene case on each tube. Tubes are then placed in chronological order by sequence number on the electronic chain of custody form for easy deployment and collection. The first sample, or the sample corresponding with an AA value of 01, will be located in the top left-hand corner of the sampling kit and are ordered vertically from left to right. In the field, the sampling kit contains everything necessary for successful sample deployment and collection, including wrenches, gloves, additional diffusion caps, and the chain of custody form paperwork. For any additional information, please contact your ALS project manager or visit alsglobal.com.